Valentine's Day for many people is not just the lovey-dovey day of the month. For others, it is full of a lot of drinking and partying. Well, my party people better brace yourselves because Uganda Breweries has a new start on you. Yes, he had to stop drunk driving. This is Showtime Extra. You know what the time is whenever it is 8.30 p.m. Thank you for watching WBS TV where quality matters. As I always say, you have good taste. My name is Bax and here's an insight on what is coming up on the show. <coughs> So the Uganda Breweries launched the red card campaign down at Gabiro's at Bugolovi. The campaign is here mainly to reduce on drunk driving, more like Kaunyamu. Irene Tale was chosen to be the brand ambassador of the campaign and she has quite strong reasons as to why she embraced the position. Here is some interviews we had at Gabiro's and a lot of fun with the performance that Irene Tale put up. Take a look. Don't drink and drive. Your actions have consequences. It's exactly what's going on at Gabiro's today. While we join UBL as it, of course, launches the campaign of the red card. Right here, I have a very smart lady, I should say. I love your style. Come here, my friend. So tell me about what you're wearing. How come you're wearing like this, like a referee, I should say? Actually, I'm wearing like a referee. Yeah. So don't right. drink and drive. Mm -hmm. I gave out a red card. Mm -hmm. So we don't advise people to drink and drive. Yeah. Okay, so how did this campaign come out? Did you realize that many people were dying or something? I realized that many people drink and they drive. So there are many consequences that come out through drinking and drive. So we try to inform our people that this is not advisable. It's not good at all to ourselves. Show them that red life. card. Show them that red card. I have to blow it off. <laughs> My friends who have drinking as the reason as to why they party hard. Kawanyamu is one of the biggest fears and we are still at Gabiro of course with the UBL of course launching their red card campaign and I'm here with a very beautiful lady. How are you doing? I'm okay. How What's are your you? name? My name is Rona Irina Itre. I work with UBL as the corporate relations executive. Okay so yes. UBL came up with a red card uh, campaign. Yes. What, what exactly is the red campaign here to do? Like, what is it? Is it trying to stop something or to promote something? Basically, what we are trying to do is encourage people to drink, but drink responsibly. A lot of consequences come when you misuse alcohol. And as a business, we realize that misuse of alcohol sometimes, or most of the times actually, causes a lot of danger. So we are here to highlight some of those dangers that way people can enjoy, still enjoy our drinks but enjoy them responsibly. So personally I find this ironic since UBL is a brewery company, you, you guys are a beer company and of sorts, so you came up with a red card campaign. Don't you fear that somehow somewhere this is going to affect your productions and marketing and Okay, for us, it's about the big picture. Misses of alcohol actually does not encourage people to drink. It discourages people to drink. For example, when you ask most people that don't drink alcohol at all, they'll, say, oh, they'll have some sort of answers that, you know, my parents used to drink, my father used to misuse alcohol and would come back home, so then I'll never drink alcohol. Or though those... those Basically, misuse of alcohol just creates bad experiences and then at the end of the day, in long term, you're just losing out customers and then you're not making more money. So okay. it's about the big picture. Okay, Rona, are you drinking tonight? Yes, I am. Are you driving tonight? No, I'm not. You have someone taking yes. it? I have my brother right there. He's okay. drinking water. I'm making sure he's taking me back home today. So we see Rona is actually practicing not drinking and driving. 
She's trying to avoid the red card. Yes. Good one, Rona. Thank you for your time. I should say it's a pleasure meeting you. You look beautiful. Nice to meet you. Too. Thank you. No, you, ha you also happen to be the ambassador of uh, the red card. Yeah. What was it like when they called you up and they're like, I really want you to be the ambassador of the red card. How did you feel? First of all, I was very excited. But mostly because I've lost someone because they were drunk driving, you know. So for me, it was not just about, oh, I'm the ambassador, but also like, okay, if I can tell someone not to drink and drive, then I could probably save their life. So for me, it was, was a nice, it was a good phone call, and it was, oh, okay, this is great, I should do this. Yeah. To all my fans out there, I have just a tiny, small message for you all. If you go out to party with your friends and you drink alcohol, you know what, do not drive. Just have someone that is sober enough to take you back home. Yeah, your safety comes first and that's it. Don't drink and drink.